Welcome, welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is Goldsmith Gaming with me, Christopher, and we're back with Endzone, a world apart in our playthrough on Advanced Difficulty, where we are playing with the Prosperity DLC, and we're going for a thousand settlers. And last time, let me just pause, by the way, because uh, I need to make sure that I am on top of everything. <laughs> uh, last time, you know, we actually finally opened up Prosperity. We built this fancy thing, the Town Hall. Isn't it looking just beautiful? Ignore the dead person in the middle of the uh, front there. Let's just look at it from, from this side instead. Yeah, see how beautiful it is. No dead people anywhere. But, yeah, we unlocked the Prosperity DLCs. We're now into uh, the ability, at least, to actually research the uh, Prosperity DLC things. We have already unlocked the Material Factory, because once you unlock the Town Hall, you start getting these things. Demands and all of that. Uh, all of that yes. And the first demand that we catered to uh, was to actually research the Material Facility. Luckily, I didn't actually have to build the thing, because we no, I don't know if we're there just yet, um, but we have it available to us. So obviously the material factory is what we need in order to make glass and strengthen metal. Now the reason why I don't feel it necessary for me to go for this just now is because I've literally not upgraded anything yet, so I'm not even close to actually needing those materials right now. So I've um, I've elected to ignore that for now. So that's uh, that's the thing that we did. We also uh, started expanding into this area a little bit more. Um, feels good. Uh, by the way, yes, I need to make sure that these don't die. I think it might have to do with the water. I think one of the points where why my animals have been dying is actually too few herders. Uh, so right now, um, well basically in, in the past I've only had one herder per pasture. Now I have two. I think two should be enough. But yeah, I think that that might actually have been a problem. So uh, yeah, we've sorted that out. And um, as for defenses and stuff like that, I think we're I think we're cool. I think that every single uh, watchtower now is full up on bullets. However, since I've now started with this area, I probably need to do more. And also, I never really know whether or not one watchtower is enough. Uh, I do remember from my last playthrough that a little bit later in the game, uh, the raider attacks became more severe and um, they passed uh, like passed through a watchtower and basically destroyed the watchtower and they just kept going so at some point i mean i can see that these watchtowers that i do have now uh, they are sort of the um, outer limit of my settlements they take care of everything so i might not need more watchtower inside but i could probably have a few more on the outside would it be the worst thing? And yeah, as I said, I have this area over here, where uh, uh, where we basically could use another one. So I have this one, I have this one, we could have one basically just here. So yeah, something to think about. We don't have a raider attack incoming just yet, so we don't have to worry about that right now. Uh, I have uh, researched the scrap catchers, and we're doing that. We're producing the scrap catchers. So um, this one is going to be the first one to try and work with just this. Uh, we don't really have a whole lot of scrap nearby, so it's a good idea to have this specific one and do that. And we're starting with two. Uh, I rem remember from my last playthrough that one wasn't really enough, and um, my idea was four. But then I realized that, wh why, why go four immediately? We can just go two to start with, and we'll see if that actually uh, is sufficient for a uh, maxed out scrapyard. We shall see. So, what are we doing in this episode? Well, we're continuing expansion over here. Uh, I have set up this scrapyard to deal with the uh, scrap over here, so we can just clear some of that out. 
And I have the other scrapyard, one of the other scrapyards, the one that is uh, here, to deal with all of this. And could probably deal with all of this as well, we shall see. But I feel, felt that the uh, truck wreck here, which is soon dealt with, is uh, the primary one, because I probably will do some food here. I think that I don't want to go further with, um, uh, further with fields here. Uh, ideally, actually, I would maybe even want to remove these fields and move them out and have like housing instead here maybe i haven't really decided on that but um for now though it, it's gonna be like this uh, do, do, i have wheat i changed i have wheat here and also here but i have so much wheat uh i have so much wheat we have a thousand two hundred that is being unused yeah we'll, we'll see about that by the way, how much hemp do I have? It's probably up here. 821, yes. Um, so right now, the uh, demand that I have is to research joints and produce joints. We do that in the pub, I think. Didn't I... No, it was only the medical facility. I'm thinking about another pub, uh, to have two pubs. Uh, you are down here, sort of catering to this... It, I could see myself having one here, actually. You know what? Uh, I might have talked about this. Never mind if I did. I am going to put another pub here. So we'll have a pub in here. We can have a bit of space between that and other things. Um, so that's about that. Which means that let's actually also plan out a little bit here. Dirt road comes out of here. Uh, let's not do that. That's nothing I can vouch for for now. And we are going to do more fields. Uh, so you... Uh, da -da 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 -da, 10 times 9 is what I've been going for. I would like to actually keep... Keep this. I haven't even built a road here. Let's do that. So there we go. So, food, I still, I haven't gotten to that yet, but I still want to make sure that I can um, make some cool looking things with like hedges and stuff. I haven't gotten to that yet, but that's, eventually I will. I mean, I'm sitting at 1668 wood, so it's not like I don't have it, but you know what I mean. I would like to have these as large as possible. I do want this to be the road, so it's going to be here. 13. What about 10? Ten? 10 times 13. Space, road, space, new field. Uh, 13 times 10. There we go. So that's like the first little bit here of more food production. Can't really do a road there yet. That's fine. Uh, we are right now in the midst of a sort of pandemic sort of thing. So, um, well, actually, we aren't, but Aren't we? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. 43 is very sick people, which is uh, why I've gone for a second medical facility. I think it's time. Um, we are actually having more herbs than medicine, which means that the people working here aren't producing medicine at the rate that we actually needed to. I do have another herbal hut here as well. So there we go. Um, I'll actually move time along now. Uh, one thing that I am going to go for in this episode, I believe, apart from the various bits and pieces, for example... Uh, yeah, oh, right, I have set up a uh, uh, another expedition. Cool. We need to upgrade things, because I've actually uh, unlocked a few things. For example, houses. Um, I haven't even started upgrading any houses. Like, none of them. I need to do that. So, uh, so, 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 temporary storeroom. I feel like this is actually mo the most important one, because, uh, well, I have one here, but that's almost full as well. So, let's actually select that one for being upgraded. Let's also go for, uh, where do I have them? You are at 86. Yeah, let's upgrade you. Uh, 97, let's upgrade you. I have a lot of builders, so actually builders are fine for now. Let's start with those. Yeah, I have 55 builders. I don't need more farmers, gatherers, hunters. Herders are fine. Uh, foresters, <laughs> I have a lot of wood. It's fine. 
Uh, all of the rest are basically filled up. I have a lot of tools, so right now tools aren't a problem. I'm sitting at a lot of metal. Question is, have I have I fixed this? How many how much metal am I producing? Because I need to produce well, I'm producing cloth in a fairly decent rate right now. I think the main problem was actually the uh, tailor shops not producing enough. And I had set some of them to neck scarves, which is arguably really, really bad, which is sort of the reason why I have contaminated settlers. Yes. So <laughs> that's that. Uh, but yeah, I have a lot of builders. So uh, let's actually move time along. Make sure that we can build as much as possible. We are getting roads down. It's all good. And um, yeah, I have the two. Ooh, we have a trader. That's you. <coughs> what do you have? You have potato seed. I would very much like that. Yes. Um, you would actually like mushroom specific, but also ooh, wheat. I have a lot of wheat. Uh, that's like nothing. Uh, so that's that's perfect. Do that. Are you mad? I'm just asking. Not mad at you, but uh, we're friends, and uh, since we're friends, you can now give me stuff uh, way cheaper. So that's another seed. Can I immediately use it? No, I cannot. I have to wait for the trade deal to be done, which is, you know, fair enough. But it would be nice to, I mean, I am sitting at a uh, very, very rich <laughs> here on the food, so it's not like I need it, but it's, uh, it would be a good thing. Right, uh, that's going well. Uh, I should have, like, everything for everything. Uh, are you already upgraded? I think you are. Cool, you are a warehouse. You are a warehouse. No, everybody's a warehouse. Um, how do I see... Oh, temporary store. Never mind, yes, obviously. Uh, bar, the, the trade deal has been closed. Cool, and I will upgrade the store. Rooms. There we go. Uh, how are you handling things, by the way? I realized that, uh, you know what? Morticians. Whack that bastard up. Because <laughs> I probably need it. Uh, that means that we can do, uh, yeah, let's do potatoes over here. Cool. Uh, I have 16 in total, which means that I actually need 32 here. Uh, not, not, not anything less. Do I go for... I mean, I have these uh, irrigation plants set up, but right now I'm not really using them. Actually. Doesn't mean that I couldn't set it up here, just to have it, but... Uh, okay, right now, no. Let's ignore that for now. Uh, has anyone died that I need to know of? Uh... I've already set up medics, which was a little bit premature. That's fine. Uh, militias are fine. No, no, no. We're, we're, we're good to go. Expedition is on their way. Also cool. Uh, this, this went really, really fast. Which is... I'm not complaining. It was just really, really fast. Um, we have another herbal hut. Cool. You don't have anything to pick up right now. Does that go for everybody. Yes, it does. No gatherers, no herbalists. Uh, just an endless amount of builders, really. Um, kinda need to make sure that... Well, actually, you know what we can do. Just max out farmers for now. And also another well keeper. By the way... Uh, by the way... We have a well here, yes. A well here those two wells really close by to each other, but that's fine. Could potentially actually see myself have a well. Yeah, we can have a well here. Uh, a well right here. Uh, can be at the back of that, basically. Yes. Uh, basically just uh, dot them around. Uh, so you... How are you, by the way? 2.8 seasons. Quite a lot of food, though. Uh, no, we'll do a shorter one as well. There we go. Uh, research is all but done. So, as soon as uh, you are built, the pub. So, 
didn't I pause the pub now that I think about it? I think I did. Well, I didn't, but I, I am now because of the fact that they are using... There we go. Um, they are using, um, like, um, berries and stuff, and I don't want them to use berries. Uh, but now we have two pubs. Uh, why am I... Why am I able to set any more pub keepers? Well, because I don't have any free people. Bloody hell. Uh, let's actually just make the well keeper ready. We have a hunter missing. Anyone else? We have a tailor missing. And miners are fine, right? Because we are doing just code, basically. How sulfur looking? Still 120. And I think... That's an autosave. Um, I think that this is actually our excess isn't it so we are uh, full up on our towers and i think that the bullets that are in this actually doesn't can take this into consideration that is ex excluding what's in the tower so we're doing fine for that so yeah i am fine with these three doing coal uh, i have you for sulfur if uh, i turn you on but we don't need to turn you on right now. So I still think that we're fine. And uh, decontamination kits we are basically maxed out on. So I don't really feel like I need more there. Yeah, I think I am looking good. And we are basically out of the um, drought period as well. Which means that it's time to not have you do that. Uh, but have you do that. Because yep. We are actually lacking that a bit. Uh, we can now pull this back. Uh, we can pull this back to 32. Half of that, yes. Uh, up to fish, uh, up to maximum fishermen. Rest on builders, and we're gonna have to go over to some herbalists at some point, yes. Uh, so that's looking good. So that's, uh, yeah, okay, so we're taking care of. Uh, an important upgrade. I mean, you're already at 75%, so... <laughs> yeah. We, we we need space. We need space. I might actually have to go for another one over here. Which isn't super weird in a way. Well, actually... You know what? Are, are we keeping... What, or is it just food here? No, there is some wood. Um, there is some wood. Raw materials. Uh, deselect all raw materials from here. We don't need raw materials in this location. Right, let's uh, have ourselves a bit of an expedition. I don't exactly know where we are. Then it's time for us to see if there's any substance to what the scout said. At any rate, it won't be any problem getting in. The sidewall of the building has caved in. Right, we are at the bar. And we have all the stuff that we need. So the bar person, so to speak, or the one with the pub keeper badge, hopefully will be able to do something good here. So, several bar stools, a bar counter, dusty bottles on the shelves. Apparently, people used to meet here for a drink after work. Also known as uh, after work. Um, in the back, there also seems to be a storeroom and stairs going up. So, let's open the counter. It's the closest one. So, hey, a baseball bat was lying under the counter. What would what would that have been good for? And a book was lying here, too. Mixology, the art of serving alcohol. We can definitely still learn a thing or two from that. And in addition to the bottles on the shelves, we found a few more underneath the floorboards. And that must indeed be the good stuff. So, some beer, some hard liquor, and also someone got the pubkeeper badge, which means that we actually didn't have to bring anyone with that. We could just have gone in anyway. Um, cool. So, the storeroom, apparently the important one, and the pubkeeper is now going to be uh, important here. Oh, hey, it tastes really good. Uh, but it packs a punch too, which means that at any rate, it still ought to be drinkable. Our pubkeeper says time and again that when the liquor is high proof, it can't go bad in the first place. I'm already looking forward to long nights by the campfire with the stuff. Oh yeah, even more hard liquor. And uh, finally, let's get up to the second floor. Or the first floor, as uh, Americans say. And hey, there are tracks here on the dusty stairs. Maybe the call for help isn't so old after all. Looks as like something was dragged up the stairs here. Ooh. Well, we're on the first floor now. Uh, the tracks here lead uh, along the hallway, but there's still another floor too. It's li it literally reeks of liquor somewhere here. Alright, uh, so let's go for the tracks. Yes, the tracks. 
<sighs> a little water uh, in his face and he was wide awake. Apparently his companions left him behind he here because a leg injury left him unable to keep up with them anymore. Good buddies, right? We're taking him with us to our settlement before he drinks himself to death here. He was so grateful, he even shared his most valuable possession with us, a new seed. So yes, indeed, we can now plant peaches, which we will. And there's also another room. Uh, there you go, one couch reduced, easy to have little pieces. He is large enough to be able to conveniently carry them to the settlement. And we just smell a few electronic parts from the TV set too, which is nice. All right, let's go to the second floor. We're at the top. The steep steps creak and squeak like crazy. And not much light gets in here either. Two rooms that we can search uh, head off from the hallway, and there's a ladder at least uh, up to the attic, attic as well. Well, let's look at the room. Almost everything here uh, is already disintegrated into dust. And we still uh, found a few pieces of jewelry and gold coins hidden in the bed and mattress. Naturally, our veteran spotted him right away. But we don't really care about jewelry and gold, so... Is that the scrap? <laughs> Probably. Uh, took part a few old pieces of electronic equipment too. Cool. Right, what's up in the attic then? Happy sellers, apparently. Uh, books, books, and more books in every single box. Apparently, there were really well-read bar owners. Oh well, we'll comb through the well-preserved copies and take along whatever sounds intriguing. Seems like there were primarily novels, so people are apparently happy about that. And that means that we are done. So let's focus on... The bear, the hard liquor, the metal, and the electronics. And scrap, yes. Can we? No, we cannot bring everything. Let's leave the wood because we have so much of it. And uh, we're not going to bring. Well, actually, you know what? Let's bring the rations. Then we just simply will bring as much scrap as we can. And. I think I'm just going to mark that for salvage once we are home. Um, how are you all feeling? I think you're all feeling fine. So, yeah, we have uh, buffaloes and goats, and we actually purchased some chickens. So now we have eggs. I do believe that eggs, however, they are food. Uh, and not like milk, which apparently isn't food. Um, right. Right, right, right. Is everything that we wanted built, built? No. We are lacking plastic here. Uh, so what are we... You know what, let's uh, move over to some more plastic here. Thank you. And we have buildings that don't have anything to do. Is that you? Yes, it is, because you just had a little tiny bit. So, um, we have one going over here. Maybe I should just do this as well. Yes, let's uh, have you do that. Cool. Um, how are you doing? How many joints have I done? 10 out of 291. <laughs> let's hope that I can get to that. Um, right, at this point, surely there are starting to come in things. How are we looking for uh, this now? We're looking fine. Food is same. Fine. Uh, nothing too cool there. Uh, let us do the thing that we, that we got, because we got something. Let's do a big orchard here. Uh, that's kind of cool. So 10 times 13, just a bit of radiation to get rid of. And now, well actually, you know what, let's just do a road here. And this is obviously an area where I can build things. Uh, probably have actually some housing here. Would it be the worst thing in the world? How are we on housing, by the way? 25, 25, that is 100% maxed out. 25, 25, 25, oh, it's... Basically, time for another one, yes. Housing, a shelter, please. Um, I think we can actually have one right by here. So let's just do that. Uh, the other way around, so it doesn't look the same. Also, 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 uh, I need knowledge. Bloody hell. Uh, are we maxed out on resources? Yes, we are. Now, it might be time for another research station. It might be time for another research station. Um, how many builders do I need specifically? Not many more, because you are almost done. So as soon as you're done, there we go. You need two, and I'm only doing this one right. Apart from that. So that's seven. Let's have exactly what we need. 
because I would like to have... Let's go for Herbalist for now, yes. Let's do that. Water is looking good now with 50 water carriers, but it's just barely, which is... Oh, it's not good, is it? No. Uh, let's go for some more Herbalist. Uh, did I have... Uh, how many did I have now? It's not in there. It is in here. Four. So 12 is a, it's, it's a good amount. Right. You, Mr. Horrible, uh, horrible radiation things. What is that? That is wild boar meat. That apparently is uh, a little bit radiated. I could actually get some water from you. And it wouldn't be the worst thing in the world. <laughs> um, we are actually looking quite low on scrap, which I don't like. Uh, but we're going to get there. Sand is that, apparently. Um... <sighs> Right now, hairs are not really what I want, so you, you know what, uh, yeah, 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 go, go away. Don't need you right now, we are not there just yet. So now, we are gonna start looking at this, because you, uh, Mr. Scrapyard, where, where are you? Yeah, you're down here. This is, this is the reason why I want these, to have it as close by as possible, to make uh, it more uh, efficient, basically. Right, we are done with the expedition. Uh, we were where? We were at the bar. We shall uh, mark that for salvaging. Uh, ooh, that, that's actually okay, an okay amount. Uh, we just have some electronics, well, a fair amount of electronics, but still. So, I guess the diner is our next step. So, you can go and you can go. You have absolutely zero protection. Uh, let's not send you. Uh, do I have anyone with protection that has the appropriate... It is only this guy. You know what? You'll get some radiation suits from me. Uh, you're you're welcome. Uh, so we have the guys that we need. And let's check for... Yeah, there are more people without protective clothing, which is... It's not good, is it? Yeah, I was creating or producing some uh, protective clothing that wasn't really the, the protective clothing we should have produced. And it shows. People have adorned, adorned the incorrect type of, uh, of protective clothing, which is arguably very, very bad. Um, right, let's go for 15 again. I think that that's fine. Tools are not needed for this, so there we go. How are we on this? Uh, do I need... I have... Three tailors here, I have four here. Uh, is, that, is that correct? Do I have... Uh, no, we have eight tailors. Where's the last one? Where have I started up here? No? Oh, right, I had one here as well, yes. Um, so I have five here and three here. I did consider starting with some up here as well, didn't I? Uh, 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 uh. Ooh, food is also not looking super hot. Um, mm, mm, mm. Ooh, I've lost scrap collectors as well. Bloody hell. Um, what can I cut down on for now? Just a little bit. Yes, mortician. So you, you don't need to be that many right now. It's fine. Um, I would like... Do we need more medics than that? I think that with two... Uh, we should be fine with just uh, four out of six, yes. So, a lot of gatherers, thank you. Uh, this should be done very, very soon. We ought to have plastic really close, but apparently we need to pick it up from... Apparently we need to pick up plastic from here. From basically the other side of town is where we're going to pick up the plastic, even though there's most likely plastic right here. And here, there's plastic everywhere, super, super close by, but no, 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 no. We, we go all our way out to pick that up. Perfect. Nice. Good job. Um, there's still some cleaning out to do here. Let's actually just go more food, because we do have a drought period incoming. Did I... Did I fail that? Really? What? How on earth did I fail that? Did I have to have it in store? Or did I simply just not produce enough? Oh, bloody hell. Uh, how much hemp do we have, by the way? Uh, two seven... Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> um, 
you are the hemp one. And I can't really I can't really go over to wheat. Uh next to this cabbage, yes. Uh wheat, wheat. Wheat, wheat. Uh you go over to hemp. Let's do joints as much as we can. Uh, how are we here? We do have a knowledge. Cool. I would like to do beer as well. So let's start that research. Uh, so that when I've opened up that, I can basically have one doing joints, one doing beers. I think that that is a good idea. Cool. Uh, you are done. So we're here. Peaches. Nice. Uh, so let's have that done. And let's just keep moving people into gatherers. We are getting hopefully some herbs in. Yeah, the food, si or rather the water situation isn't terribly good. I think. Do want to go even more, even more? I think I do. So as we are moving into another drought period, let's uh, plan out here. Uh, you can come down here, and you can come down here. Let's just go as close by to the water as we can. Not here, though, now that I think about it. Okay, well, let's start there. Uh, a Yeti over here, which can actually... Yeah, that's nice. Fit in perfectly there. We'll have a water tower just next by. And you know what? Why not? Why not have a fishing hut? So that means that we should not have set up roads like that. That was stupid of me. Another fishing out here, just to make sure that we sort of have the ability to do it. Uh, so you go here, like so. And you... Why can I sort of select other buildings? Uh, never mind. Uh, just like that, so this is the only thing that you work on. Cool. Uh, just wait for the drought period. And we are now finally building this. How much do you already have? 94. Um, as soon as you're done, obviously, we are moving over to the scrap catcher. We'll see what happens there. Right, drought period. None of you, none of you. Max out these for now. Refiners, scrap collectors. I probably should do another scrap collector as well. So we have one here, one here, and one here. I would like to have something up here. Um, where's the, where's the, the forester? I mean, I could fit stuff in here. Like, I could fit some scrap catchers in, well, actually, sort of in here. Uh, again, uh, you don't need the entire area from the forester. Uh, it's not actually needed. 651 is plenty enough. I am actually dropping down a little bit, so, you know what, during this drop period, let's, uh, get some of that back. Um, but we are lacking one miner, one medic. How are you guys? You are basically full up. <laughs> uh, let's do uh, let's do like ten at least. That seems fine. Uh, we don't need any of the others. So farmers up to max. Ooh, not a lot of people being builders. And I also have destroyed buildings. But none that are problematic. Uh, that's that's close and that's close. So actually, not a problem whatsoever. Uh, some some mildly disrupt, disrupted buildings here. Um, that's a okay. So 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 so. Uh, how are you guys feeling? You are feeling fine. Probably should uh, prepare another. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's also prepare another... Uh, not you, you. Uh, I would like for you... Can I... Where, where is the... Yeah, the building is right there. Let's have you just next by to this one. I will have a road coming in. And I actually do want a road coming like that. There we go. Uh, this one obviously prioritized. And I think... I think that, yeah, it's actually just going to be 10 builders. For now, I mean, we do have the gatherers and uh, herbalists. They are not going to be doing that all the time. Right. Um, ooh, 
I didn't build a store storeroom over here. We should do that. And now I have access to the big storeroom. So let's oh that fits perfectly in here. So prioritize this please, if you would. Doesn't look like they are. Uh you are back, what do you have on this occasion? Um Okay, fine. Let's do you. Uh how many mushrooms do you want for that? One thousand, that's a bit too much. Um, I do have some bears. Uh, not that many. Would you like all my bears? You would not really like all my bears. Well, you would, but that's not enough. Nah, I don't really want to do that. I mean, I could give you sulfur, but you don't really want... You, need, you, you want a lot of that. Uh... Not even, not even this is actually that valuable to you. Okay, you know what? No, screw you. Uh, I, I need better stuff to... Ooh, is it actually a new person? Ooh. Ah, no, 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 never mind. I, th I thought we were at, at a situation where we knew. Uh, but no, we need the antenna thingy thingy. So, uh, we do have scrap here. Let's see now how this will work. Will I need more than one? Or r rather, more than two. Because two is what I built. Um, uh, well, okay, now we are getting a storm. So, these are gonna basically fill up. <laughs> In the completion. Uh, so let's look at that. Oh, do, 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 do. So probably quite a lot, yes. <laughs> um, right. Uh, 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 more builders right now, but we are gonna get as soon as the food drops down, which is now. Drop all of that down, drop all of it into builders. Take care of everything that needs to ta be taken care of. You are actually, yeah, you are not being repaired because you are also paused. Do I need you? I think I don't need you. So you can keep being paused. I actually do need to consider, I see now, even more uh, tailor shops. Can't build one there, which is a bit annoying, but can I fit one in there? Yes, I can. Cool. Uh, Oh, we are actually lacking scrap because of that little storm. Ouch. Okay. You. Yeah, we're, yeah we are ooh, not good. <laughs> not good at all. Um, okay, we now have raiders. You are obviously coming from below. Because why wouldn't you? But this is where I have at least three. So we should be fine. So this occasion, I'm not going to do anything, obviously. Uh, research done. So, what is the next step? I am thinking actually of doing like the upgraded shelter to have that as well. We heard we have the sturdy house, which we haven't begun with, but we have it. Uh, in prosperity, what does the upgraded pub do? Uh, Beer Harley can rejoice, which is blah blah blah. More effectively, basically. Okay, fine. What is a factory unit? Consumes different resources such as concrete, reinforced metal, and glass, or to increase the efficiency of the neighboring production buildings. Uh, tailor shop, workshop, ammunition factory, medical city, and decontamination post. Huh. That's kind of cool. So basically, just utilizing the new materials in order to make these things more efficient. I like that. We all also obviously have cement mining, which means that we can uh, mine cement, and specifically a sand mine. This is not from the same mine as everything else. However, since we are in sort of a pickle with uh, uh, clothing, I actually think that the upgraded tailor shop is something to go for. So let's actually do that. Let's go for that. Right, uh, we have water back. Uh, let's not have... is that built? It is not built. Um, did I, by the way, did I set this up? It is here. Yeah, repair buildings. Cool. Do that first. And scrap is becoming a problem. Yes. Um, food isn't so much of a problem. Let's drop this down to that. Water carriers. Uh, let's drop this down to 34. 
And you guys, I completely... No, 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 I didn't. Never mind. I, I, I remembered. Not a problem. Down to 34. You up to 28. And then we need builders. I did not do anything about uh, forestry on this occasion, but uh, can't really, can't really s say that I need that, so to speak, right now. Um, I'm slowly thinking that we do need more than two, because we sort of need this um, this number to not go down. I think it is slowly going down. We have another trader coming in. It's you. Uh, you actually have cement if I would like to have that. Uh, not right now. I would like all your scrap though. Yes. Uh, you can have the contamination kits. That's 100% okay. Uh, wouldn't mind porting with that at all. Uh, could actually with some herbs because you don't need a lot to be happy there we go cool get some scrap from you not really something I thought I would be doing but here we are uh, right let's do an expedition and see what's going on on this occasion just like the scout reported not much left standing from the building anymore the upper floors have caved in but we can take a look at the ground floor. Uh-huh. Well, let's check that out then. So, everything is pretty run down here. No wonder with no pr protection at all against the weather. I can imagine there are any pickings left on the caved-in upper floors. We'd uh, better off taking a look at what's left in the kitchen, you say. Well, fine. Let's do kitchen. Uh, we, we removed all the electronic components. The number of things you find built into an old fridge is nothing to sneeze at. Turned out to be a piece of cake for our technician. But hey, wait a sec, we nearly overlooked a hatch in the floor that was buried under all the dust and grime. What would you know? The hatch seems to, be, seems to lead to a basement. Maybe there was once a storeroom or a room like it down here. Uh, let's take a look. Yes, indeed, let's do that. Well, the sacks uh, are full of shriveled up old beans. Not edible. Hold on, there's a human skeleton lying between the sacks and the corner. It looks like all the teeth are miss missing from the skull and something has been scratched onto the wall. Forgot camp stove. Did you try to survive by living on raw beans? That's that's not nice. Um, okay, a batch, but that's not super fun, but sure. Right, let's uh, get up. I'm on the debris at the very top. There was still some scrap that our experts spotted. That was one heck of a climb. Luckily, nothing happened. So this location was completely pointless. Uh, oh well. Uh, I can't even bring all the expedition rations. Um, I have so much electronics right now, don't I? Yeah, 400 of it. I mean, it's gonna come in handy once we start with uh, uh, power construction, but uh, right now, not so much. Right, let's uh, again go back to this. How are you looking? And also the situation here. Yeah, we're, we're, we're on top of that, I think. Cool. Uh, the barter deal has been done, so we are not good for scrap, but it's fine. Uh, it does look like I might need... If I have one more. Three, then. Because it's going up a little bit in between pickups, but as soon as they pick up, I think it's going down. Right? It's a bit difficult to tell. It's fine for now. So, you know what? Let's uh, look into this place here. I would like, in the resources, where is the, the scrap catcher is here. Uh, of course, there are scrap that needs to pick up. Bloody hell, aren't you? What are you doing? Uh, wh wherever the hell you are. Well, fine. We need to wait then, I guess. Uh, you know what? No, we don't. Well, actually, okay, fine. You are carrying, or rather, picking up stuff from far away right now. Let's uh, make sure that you have uh, the scrap catchers, because I was planning on having them here. Which, again, I realized that I'm taking part from the forest. But as we can see, there's so much food and herbs, so it's not really a problem. So, we are going to have a scrap catcher here and a scrap catcher here. Let's start with two here as well and same thing as before i probably should have uh, kept uh, or rather left a little bit of a space in between here but i didn't and why on earth are you doing that you're supposed to do that 
So there we go, and I'll I'll do that for now. Yes. Um, so how are we looking here? We are all but done. There are a couple. Do we not have what's needed to repair this? Okay. Repair that, please. Because that that's, hasn't... Oh, is that actually... Oh, never mind. Is that also... Also, also, also... Yes, that's past buildings. Never mind. Uh, you. Uh, replace building. There we go. Uh, you need to be just done. There we go. Cool. Expedition is home. Uh, we are almost done with expedition. It's kind of nice to be done with expeditions because uh, then we can just focus those people on other things. Uh, I will mark this for a salvage, which means that we only really have one proper one left, the combine harvester here. We don't need uh, anything <laughs> to be able to do this. And the chances are that we actually don't need that many people either. So let's uh, still bring quite a lot. I'm probably going to bring a full group, but I'm not going to bring all that many uh, rations. Rations uh, is what I'm thinking here. Yeah, we have people here. Let's bring like six, I'm thinking. And I'm going to have um, I'm gonna have radiation suit marked, even though they should all have it. Uh, just make sure that they are not traveling without it. How are we doing for tools? We are still looking fine. Uh... You are soon being done, I think. Looks like people are working on you. Yes, indeed. How are you feeling? Th still hovering around 400. That's actually pretty damn good. Uh, we have some stuff being built. You are all but full, but we have some space now, so that's cool. One thing that I wanted to start this uh, episode as well was upgrading the houses. We're not really there just now. I gotta say. Um, we do have a bit too many builders right now, however. Uh, water, just keep on doing that. Yes, uh, you need your filter turned on. How are we? Coal is fine. Not a problem. Hunters up to uh, max. Let's actually bring in some more foresters. Another scrap collector, refiner, tailors. Don't run low on that. Pubkeeper, did I set that up now, by the way? I probably didn't. No, bear over here. Bear over here. Uh, did we build the, yes we did. We now have the warehouse over here. Food is running low, which means that I, um, how is this looking? <sighs> also not good. All right. All right, all right, all right. Uh, Gatherers. Probably should think. Oh, we are. I have a lot of morticians. We don't need that many. Let's have. Uh, you actually didn't need more than four. So let's have you on that. Oh, right. I actually need. No, no, no. No, no, no. I, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. It was six. Yes. Uh, right. Keep going. Drop period coming. We know. And even with 60 water carriers right now. Oh, wow. Okay. So even with 60 water carriers, we are just scraping by. Uh, we don't need that. We don't need any of that. At least I don't think so. So you can go away. How are you doing, by the way, Peach? Doing fine. Um... How's this looking, by the way? This should be... There's some metal bullets in there as well, would you know? Uh, but yeah, water. Was climbing now. I guess there's sort of a bit of a hump you need to get over as soon as you're over that. It starts uh, increasing quite a lot. Um, wouldn't mind probably having even more fields. Um, but we're getting quite a lot of food out of these once they are being harvested, so that's a good thing. Um... What else? I do need some herbalists, so let's get that in. We are fine with the rest. You? No, god damn it. <laughs> They're producing neck scarves again. Did not want that. Um, right, 
how are you feeling? You are very close, very close. They did the roads, I think. Didn't they? Or did they? I think they did the roads. Even though it doesn't necessarily look like it. Yeah, it's because it's like right at the back of the buildings there. So as soon as this is done, what are you? Oh, wow, we have burned through cl Wow, okay. Um, <clears throat> yes, more cloth. Uh, we still have metal. I mean, I do. I am producing quite a lot of cloth over here. Oh, am I? Wait, what? No work. No, refiner, bloody hell. Look at the right thing. Um, let's pull... Uh, ooh, what do I pull off of? Uh, you know, militia, we don't need militia right now. That's uh, that's for soon, when the, when the raiders announce their introduction, so to speak. Uh, we don't need militia right now. They are very, very pointless. Um, knowledge, we are right. I can, I can just look over here. I, I can see. I can see it right here. Uh, we need two points for the advanced, uh, advanced uh, tailor shop. But yeah, we are struggling with cloth. As a matter of fact, uh, you have chickens. We have chickens. We don't need chickens. We do need cloth, though. What can I give you for that? I can give you some beer. If you would like, I can give you not sulfur, not tools, a bit of plastic, a bit of plastic, and yeah, okay, fine, now we can give you some mushrooms, because I'm feeling generous. Give me that cloth, please. There we go, thank you for that. Do we have another, bloody hell, another disease? Holy crap. Well, now we have two working medical facilities, so that's good, but wow, okay. <laughs> we need more herbalists, like pronto. Uh, what can I pull off of? I can pull off here. So what is a third? That would be 17. You can now only be one on each of these. Each of these, uh, sorry to say. Yeah, I need more stuff here. Uh, that is fine. How are we looking here, by the way? Uh, you are... Yeah, see, it's actually gone down. So, two is actually not enough. I see that now. Uh, right, let's do an expedition. We've made it, Chief. I wish we were able to get this thing back in shape again. It'd save us a ton of work at home. At any rate, we'll take a look around. Uh-huh, let's do that. Look around the harvester. Uh, maybe we'll fi still find useful stuff in the cockpit cockpit or the canister. Let's start with the cockpit. Um, it's uh, It was easy to get the cockpit door open, chief. Sadly, there's not much uh, to be had, but we did find an old photo of a cornfield and two people arm in arm under the seat. There are two seat kernels glued to the picture. For Sarah, for our future. It's written on the photo. Too bad the two of them probably won't live to see the future anymore, or luckily for them. And we do get carrot seed, which is actually very, very useful. Someone got sick. Damn it! One of us fell in the, into the canister. How the hell did you do that? Uh, and it seems uh, to sprain something. It's uh, no piece of cake getting someone back out of there, and the canister was empty too, so all the effort wasn't worth a thing. And there we go. We are done. There is absolutely nothing to lose. Just bring the rations back. And with that, we are basically done with the expeditions. Unless I want to go and loot the place, but we are actually looking okay now, again. Uh... But yeah, this one is gonna sort of hover, uh, which means that it's gonna be, it's gonna tell me that it's, uh, that it is lacking uh, resources back and forth, which is gonna be a bit annoying. Um, right, yeah, herbs, we need a lot of herbs. Uh, fair enough. Uh, food, fisherman gatherers, yes. Uh, are you both built? Yes, you are. What are you doing? You are, like, way out of the way. So start working here instead. Be more efficient. I mean, it's looking good now. Uh, but one little storm and it's basically game over in, in a way. Uh, we are waiting for this to clear up so we can build more uh, scrap collecting here. Just to make sure that we have the capacity, so to speak. Uh, all the herbalists are filled up. 
Do we need more herbalists? It doesn't necessarily feel like a do, right? Uh, no, we are actually getting a surplus. Not a surplus, but we are making a healthy profit right here. Uh, you're all done. Let's move that into gatherers. There we go. Uh, cloth is coming in. I think. Uh, but I do think... Yeah, okay, so we might have to start thinking about the refinery as well. I don't like the refinery, because I don't understand it. <laughs> I might have to sort of play around a little bit with it between episodes to so see how you're supposed to make do with it. But for now, I don't necessarily like it. We shall see what I do with that. Um, but as for... Oh, right. Okay. Oh, wow. We have we have water. <clears throat> we have water. Yes. <laughs> uh, we don't need that much water. I have six towers. Yes. So... Uh, Okay, fine, let's, uh, six, uh, what is that, six times nine. Uh, I am not good at math, but it should be 54, right? <laughs> holy, holy crap. Um, that was difficult. Um, so we have another paster as well. We have, uh, let's just remember, the chicken, buffalo, and goat. Uh, so we don't need that, we need something else. Um, we can... We're making cabbage here. Let's uh, move over to uh, carrots because we can uh, again get having this rich food nice and high. Not a bad idea. Uh, another scrap catcher is good. I probably don't need 54 water carries either. I do want to have it though. Uh, what I probably would like to do because I do see that the I pr let's just see after the raider attack, I'll see the situation here uh, and then I'll make a decision on what to do with sulfur mining. I would actually not mind increasing this to four now. I'm not running low on coal but I would like to have just a little bit more. So one, two, three goes in there. You are uh, handling things I believe. So that's good. Uh, might be a time to have another cemetery over here, by the way, now that I think about it. Could have one... Eh, maybe here, even. I mean, we are expanding into this area, so why not? There's even more water over here, so I wouldn't actually mind sort of looping around here. That would be kind of cool. We are moving into this uh, direction, so yeah. Could be a thing. But yeah, I think that I'm happy here. We're going to leave uh, off just before a drought period on this occasion. And uh, we have a looming, uh, a looming at eminent, rather imminent raider attack, which is always a problem. The epidemic is soon over. One thing that we should probably consider... <laughs> I've just ignored it. The forum. I totally ignored the forum, by the way. Yes. Can I fit the forum in, in somewhere cool? Like over here. Yeah, yeah, I could fit it in here, actually. Uh, let's, uh, see if I can remember that I'm doing this, if I remove these. Uh, the forum might go in over here. And, uh, I've been thinking about schools. We are, uh, almost maxing school capacity, which means that a school over here, as we are expanding, uh, settlers into here, might be a good idea. So we have a couple of things to do in the next episode as well, I believe. You are full up. Yeah, you are the... Decontamination kits, that is fine. Right, let's just do one auto save to finish this episode off. And here we have it a nice little save, and that's about it. So, more of this is gonna come in the next episode. For now, though, this has been Ghostsmith Gaming with me, Christopher. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.